and the facts contradict your excuses. Christ has given you light. This is why we, we recognize the utter folly of seeking to attract the masses by bringing entertainment into the church. You know, the, the idea is if we can just connect, I mean, if we can just make church in a way that will make people from outside in the community feel more warm and excited and, and, uh, and attracted and so on, then, then that will do it. And so we can turn the church into a circus and we can bring all this other entertainment in. And if you just tweak the, the worship, don't stick to these simple little th- means that God has given. You've got to embellish it in order to, in order to extend an influence. Uh, over the community and so on. What's happening there? You can see it in this text. Someone who thinks along those lines has missed the point entirely. And it is a basic point at that. The problem is not that the context of church is not suited to be attractive to people and so on. The problem is within the souls of men. It's a moral problem. Men What they need is the light to shine upon them. And the problem is not more entertainment that's needed. If they've got the light, the problem is that they are hating the light. They're turning away from the light. And so that 